Right, I'm having to video. The other camera's got overheated. I'm not calling it down at the moment. Now this one's all right on video, this little camera, but it doesn't take photos very well. It comes out all white. It did work for a little while and then it went back to it, so I don't know. So anyway, we're going down this more drove, more and more drove. It's a lot of drove, this walk. My feet are a little bit achy. A little bit sore actually, I've got new socks on as well. I did rinse them out though. Um, God, do you know what, my bag feels so light I haven't even done the waistband up yet. I've still got, I've still got a big water, haven't I? Yeah. So what I thought I'd do is um, use the video. We're coming down to Colbone very soon. There's two ways to it. I might do the the other way this time. There is a shortcut way where you go under the bridge and come out in the garden that way. Or you can go down the other way. I don't know. I think one's longer than the other. That's in trouble. I'll see you when I get there. There's a sign coming up. It's only half past three, by the way. I'm really pleased with myself. So it's taken me three hours. And that includes going up in extreme heat, climbing a big hill as well. well I'll find out the name of that hill. <sighs> Do you know what I mean? It's just... It's just amazing. <sighs> no, I don't think I would have wanted to do it there and back. Not at the moment. Not with my feet and knee being a bit dodgy. Right, now this is where you get a junction point. You've got a footpath there. Or you've got the coastal path of Porlock Weir. Now last time I was here, I went down through there. Or you can go with but this time I'm going this way. I'm going this way. I, I can't remember this bit. So I'm going this way. Something different. And I'll video it. Oh, I can't touch your knee. Yeah, I went down through there that last time. Church isn't that far away. It is dark. It's always dark here, by the way. It's very peaceful and dark and spooky. Oh. So I'm using this, this camera. I used the other one last night to do but if, as long as no one steals the camera while I was out, um, there should be some quite good pictures and videos that I did last night on the Sony. But Sony would not work. It only did a little bit and it stopped and that's it. So I, it's packed up. This one's packed up. It has done it occasionally before. Um, I've just, I'm just resting it, but I did, I didn't throw it on the floor, I did sort of just gently, when I had to climb over a gate, <sighs> I could have broken it, they're only cheap things, oh well not, it was 164 quid, I can't believe how quickly my Sony's packed up, except that I do w work them to death. <sighs> yeah, my feet. I am feeling, when I go downhill, it's an absolute nightmare for me with my feet in these shoes. My feet are really hurting. <sighs> They're really, really hurting me. Should have carried my sandals out today, actually. I don't know why I didn't think of it. I've got them on the campsite in case it's wet. I could have put them in the rucksack. Although they aren't very good for walking out in stony places, really. Nah. Oh, God, my feet hurt. So that is pretty good. Half past three. Bloody excellent. Hopefully the church will still be open. I've probably only got half an hour before they shut it though. 
let me shut it at five maybe. But I can't walk quick because my feet and my knees hurt. away for ages. Two years. I think, yeah. It was two years ago. <sighs> spooky with this. It's a spooky place. Very spooky, I find. Reminds me of the Quantocks a bit. It's a sum of Exmoor. The trees are very gnarled. I can't rush, my feet are killing me. I'm gonna try and walk on this moss. I bet other people have done this because the stones. Oh, when you've done a big walk. Oh, my feet are killing me. I did say to myself, you should wear the old ones for the, over here. Break the, you know. I mean, it will be broken in these. This will break them in. But they've still got that fault. It's a fault. Oh. You know, come on, Sheila, just take some deep breaths, look. Oh. I think I can see. Yeah, what happens, we curl round in a minute and go down that way, I think. Look at those lovely trees though. I don't know what it'll come out with on this camera because I think a lot of it gets blurred. But it's better than nothing. The other one might cool down and be alright in a minute. If not, it's broken. I only gently drops it onto grass. Walkers find it painful though, this bit, to be quite honest. I mean, I remember when I, I ran the London Marathon three times, right? And we used, we'd already done about 17 miles, I think, or it might have been 14. And we had to run across the Tower of London cobbles. They got rid of it later on, you know, because I think it injured, injured a lot of people. You know, because, you know, when you're at that stage... Every bump and jerk is painful, and that's what I'm feeling now. Every stone seems to be penetrating my foot. My toes feel like they're crunched in half. Do you know, I took the shoes back. I bought, these are the second pair of brand new trainers, which are identical to my old ones, which my old ones are fabulous. It's that they're old now. Everything's wearing on them. But these are, I pointed out to him, I said, these are not right. They're short in the toe. They say seven, but they're not. He didn't talk to me for a while, that bloke, when I went in there. I mean, I was, I had every right to point it out to him. Oh, much further, Shell. What a lovely scene, though, and I can't even take a picture of it. I'll try with this camera when it's dark. Let's see if we can. Quarter of a mile, I think. One and three quarters of a mile. Uh, what's the 
Yeah, I'm going to go and Is that movie? Is that... Am I doing movie? Yeah, sorry. I'm using the little camera, the little Sony. And sometimes it does come out all right. The pictures seem to have worked. I was just saying how this little church reminds me of my sister Jude. Um, it's serenity. It's peace. Yeah. Reminds me of her. I'm sure we had a carpet like that once when I was a kid. <sighs> a thousand years, shepherds put their mark. Um. <sighs> I've already got a cold bone one. I might take another. Like, I don't know where it is at the moment. And it was handy when I do the narration for the video. Lovely, peaceful place. God bless you, Jude. I do miss you. Can't believe you're gone. I'm not a very good sister, was I? I'll be back. I'll come back again another day. Might be a couple of years, but I will be back. Oh, I have got that one, I've got the bigger one. I want to go and sit in the shade and take my shoes off for a minute. Oh, I do love this church. This is a Jude's church. It reminds me of her. And I know she's been here. That's, what my, that's what's even good about it. Is that I know. do a little video and then I'm gonna rest my feet for a minute hmm. wish I could put my feet in that stream
sit here if it's shady. Well, that looks like a grave there, doesn't it? Can you hear the stream in the background? The smell of freshly sawn wood, I can smell. I love that church. It should be called St. Jude's. I can imagine them being here, Jude and Stuart. Walking around, I can imagine them. I miss Jude. I miss her. Can She's gone forever. It's a horrible feeling. It's a horrible, horrible feeling. She just came into my life for a short time. Oh, God. Right, I've got to take my shoes off for a minute because my feet really aching just for a little while so I'm going to turn off for a minute I'll just take some pictures